Let's get sweaty. Hey guys, welcome to a Shenmue Dojo video. Today's video is going to be focusing on a new fan project. I say new fan project, it's been in the works a little while. You may have seen some screenshots of this if you've been in our Discord server. The link to that is below. Um, to, overnight, Joe Kitchen released um, all the cut scenes from the Dreams of Saturn fan game made by George Kitchen, which came out just before Christmas. He's released a compilation of literally all the scenes from start to finish, which is quite a nice little touch. You're going to check that out if you haven't done so already. But sort of hidden at the end of this video but not quite is a very very small teaser trailer for georgie's new game uh shenmue guilin adventures so what i'm going to do guys is i'm going to bring this up onto the screen right now for you and then have a quick look and chat about what it is so it's coming up on the screen right now So there we are, guys. That's our first look at Shenmue Guilin Adventures. I think the biggest thing that stands out with this is the fact it pretty much looks like it, your Shenmue 3 would have done had it been released back on the Dreamcast. That is a massive, massive compliment to this thing. Um, the aesthetic of Guilin is, is captured absolutely perfectly um, using the Dreamcast textures from the original games. Well, I say Dreamcast textures, up from the HD re-releases rather. Anyway, so a little bit of details here. There's going to be more information coming out in April. I don't quite know what that information is or isn't going to be. We'll have to check that out. But I'm hoping more videos and screenshots, etc. Um, I'm also looking at, from what I can gather, is a, re a September release. But looking at it, I whether that gets moved or not, I don't know. Judging on Dreams of Saturn, if you haven't checked that out, make sure you do so. Um, that may get pushed back a little bit uh, until George is very happy with it. He's working on this very much on his own, although he does get input, obviously, from his brother to help do the cutscenes and other people. It's very much his project, and George is very much a perfectionist, and he will want to release the best possible version of this game. So it may get shifted back depending on how things are going. But in terms of the look, the music, the aesthetics, um, already I'm excited to see this. Um, like I said, it's, it's like playing Shenmue, three on a dreamcast for the very first time which is a humongous compliment to this game and a humongous compliment to how this thing is going to turn out and if it's anything like dreams of saturn bear in mind how good a fan game that was this bear in mind he's now had that experience with dreams of saturn is going to knock this out of the park in my opinion i can't wait to see more of it and again this is a testament to the shenmue fan community with, with all the fan projects that are going around at the moment starting with yeah, the dragon of phoenix project which is a massive scale project and then you've got all these other projects dotted around with it and george is very much at the center of this with obviously dreams of saturn and this new shenmue guilin adventures game as well there's shenmue 4 2.5 d coming out very soon i think there's a demo due in march potentially as well um, and there's a few other small little fan projects that I've been lucky enough to see. And if you've been in our Discord server, you probably would have seen some of these already. Um, and again, it's just showing the talent 
that is available to the Shenmue community and keeping things going within the community while we wait for Shenmue 4. But guys, drop us some feedback around this game. What do you think of it? What do you think of the trailer? What do you want to see from this new game? And I'll be back with a video on Saturday. But for now, guys, take care. Have a good one.